I sat down with my friends Florin and Saar to review a cold email that Florin received that hit the mark. And this one included a video. Let's check it out. Loom security breach. Hey Florin, I saw your LinkedIn post three weeks ago about using Loom as your video vendor. First thing right away went into context and a good trigger. So not just I saw your LinkedIn post, but three weeks ago specifically where you mentioned Loom as your video vendor, which is true. I like that she made it time specific. So again, like clear show that uh, she did her research. Curious after yesterday's security breach, are you reconsidering? Went right into like uh, a potential problem that she was almost educating me essentially. I had no idea there was a security breach. Are you reconsidering? I thought it was like a bold and right away I'm like, whoa, there was a security breach. What's happening? That's interesting. We work with companies like BNY Mellon and Salesforce and have passed the most stringent security reviews to ensure this never happens for our customers. That second sentence goes right into social proof. The, I think the miss with the social proof here is that uh, they decided to go with very large enterprise brands, which I guess why would that would be important from a security standpoint as essentially saying that like, hey, like if Salesforce and BNY Mellon trust us, then you should too. But I still think in some way, like for us, we're a small startup. We're just not in the same realm uh, as Salesforce and BNY Mellon. And realistically, like a security breach is not as big of an issue for us as it would be for like a large enterprise company. So in some way that probably didn't land as great with me as a sales leader as it might have with, uh, for example, reaching out to like our operations or IT team. I made you this quick video in case it's worth a discussion. It will take less than 60 seconds of your busy day to watch. I promise. Before the video, I actually like how she lined it up and she said, it'll take less than 60 seconds. I know your uh, day's busy. So it just made it like super simple and like there's self-awareness around the fact that, you know, as sales leaders, you're going to be busy. Uh, and then there's the thumbnail, which is on my LinkedIn profile. So that also caught my uh, attention. It shows that it's personal and that she spent time actually creating a video for me. Hey, Florin, Alice here from Vidyard. Wanted to make you this quick video, seeing as you are the director of sales over at Barley. And in the past, you did work over at Lupio, somewhere down the line here, um, who, of course, as I'm sure you know, have been Vidyard customers and continue to do so. I also saw your post um, mentioning that Loom is your video vendor and was curious after yesterday's security breach, if that's something that you're reconsidering. Not only do we ensure that something like this never happens to our customers, we also are helping teams just like yours increase reply rates by 26%, book at least 30% more meetings and close up to 41% more revenue. So can give you a full demo pricing all in one call. If it's not worth uh, moving forward after that, no worries, no strings attached. In the last six months, I think I've gotten two like proper video outbound messages. So it does stick out. Would love to talk through some of the ideas mentioned. Worth a combo. Hope to speak soon. Alice at Vidyard. Ended it off nicely as well, where it was like, uh, is it worth a conversation? It wasn't trying to book a meeting with me. It was just, just wanted to start uh, a conversation. So really good job. When when something triggers your brain to thinking, oh, there could be something going on, that that's powerful. So you're educating, you're capturing their attention with personalization, and then you're provoking them to think with relevance. And then you're doing some sort of social proof, which is, you know, you know there's a little bit of a tweak at this point, and you're going for the clean ass. And she's got video in there.